What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today, we're back with a brand new WWE action figure appointment episode. I believe it's episode number 22. And we have not done an appointment in a very long time. I think the last time we did it was probably seven months ago, which is absolutely absurd. I feel like this year has been insane with reviews, and I actually even tweeted about it the other day. I even posted on my Instagram about it. May even make a whole video about it, honestly, because I think it's something that we need to discuss here on the channel, and we might do so. But today, we're finally back. Dr. Whitekiss is back in office finally after the long hiatus. Honestly, kind of concerned for my fingers. I, I, like, hopefully it won't, like, hurt me too bad today, but we are going to find out here together what takes place today. We're going to find out together, man, but we do a bunch of new figures here. I'm excited to do so because a lot of this stuff should be relatively easy. You guys know that with the new figures, the head swaps are very easily easeable. It's just like Hasbro now. You can just pop the head off, pop it back on, something they probably should have implemented forever ago, but better late than never, I guess so, and so we have plenty of figures today. If you guys don't know what action figure appointment is, it is a watered down version of action figure surgery, which all that means is just, it's kind of like a shorter episode of WWE action figure surgery, which I thought we were going to be able to do surgery, but I don't know, man. It's it's to the point now where a lot of surgery stuff is going to have to be painted. You know, painted is like one thing. The second thing is it's probably going to have to be probably a head swap or, or something else. They don't, you know, usually we used to plug in new WWE figure series, AEW figures into any new wave we get we just plug it into surgery and fix up all the different problems with them but a lot of the last few waves have been pretty much a, a smash hit so we'll get into all that man but let's get into what we're going to do here on an appointment and then we will get into said surgery slash appointment that we're doing and the goal of this is to be out of here in under 15 minutes will that happen let's find out together man but first of all we have becky lynch right here now one of my favorite becky lynch figures i've ever done before for a fix up is this ultimate edition i put one of the basic heads on there i think it looks a hell of a lot better than the ultimate edition i think the ultra ultimate edition was a trap but I'm actually going to stick this head sculpt onto the new Survivor Series Elite just to see what it looks like. So I'm going to switch these heads. I know this head will look good on anything, and I think this head over here will really bring this together. Even though I don't hate either figure, I just think it would change it up just a bit. Change the pace up a little bit. I think that'll be a pretty cool fix-up. Next up is Eddie Guerrero. We have the new Elite 95 Eddie Guerrero, and we have the Legends Eddie Guerrero. Going to switch these heads. Think that'd be awesome. I honestly forgot that I put these Andrade arms on here, and look how much better that looks. That's kind of crazy. I think we did that on surgery before too but you guys know that the elite 95 i don't really care for the head sculpt i don't know about you guys but i don't really care for it i'm gonna put this legends head on there just to see what it looks like we need new we need more eddie guerreros i'm hoping in the next crowdfunder we get an ultimate edition eddie guerrero in there i think that'd be cool but we also have kofi kingston now this one i think i'm, I'm not gonna finish here because i, I want to do some stuff on surgery when we finally get to the next surgery episode i think i'm going to uh, paint these jordans up and try to make in like replicate them as best as possible but we do have elite 96 kofi Kofi Kingston, and then we have this older top talents, Kofi Kingston. I'm gonna switch the heads on these. I just think this smiling head would look better on the Skeletor gear, and then I'm going to... I feel like there was something else I wanted to do, but I know I'm, I'm switching the heads. We're definitely switching the heads on those guys. We're also going to be fixing up these Undertakers with head swaps, as well as this Ultimate Edition, like, you know, roll back tongue out head. I'm gonna be fixing up the Elite One and the uh, Greatest Hits figure, and then we're also going to be fixing up the Elite Series, uh, not the Elite Series, the Unmatched Series 1 Mirror figure with the extra head sculpt from the Unrivaled 10. And then last but not least, don't ruin the illusion. Last but not least, man, we're going to fix up our Undisputed Era War Games Adam Cole that we've been waiting to do so forever. We're going to put the Bo Dallas legs on there, fix up the legs, and put small knee pads on there, and fix this up because I hate the tiny legs they give him. I can't I can't stand it. It really just, it, it, it grinds my gear. So we're going to fix that up. But with all that being said, man, let's dive into surgery. Let's get our swaps and swippages going, or swippages, swappages, all this good stuff. We're going to get that going man let's go ahead and get into it and we can proceed with the surgery today all right guys so first order of business is going to be the adam cole i went ahead and pulled off the shirt i went ahead and put off his armbands and all that stuff so it should be relatively simple you know but <laughs> uh what is simple nowadays you know what i mean so here is the we're gonna hit him in the splitsies with a white trusty hair dryer i also got this rvd figure that has the knee pads that i needed so i'm just gonna heat up his kick pads right here and heat that up at the same time and and then put on these open knee pads onto the RVD. Take the RVD knee pads, put those on the Adam Cole. You guys get the deal. So we'll we'll be doing that as well. I also, before we get into this portion, I also find this ba basic Becky Lynch just laying around. So I'm gonna put this head sculpt onto the Survivor Series and leave the Ultimate Edition the way it is because I like the way the Ultimate Edition looks. I like the ponytail head sculpt better than the hair down. I think so. We'll just roll with that and we'll, we'll just see how it goes. But anyways, let's go ahead and hit it. White trusty hair dryer, do your thing, and then we will move on to the next portion of. Of 
have our appointment episode. All right, man, again, haven't been, a, haven't done this in a while, so I may fail miserably, you know, because I haven't done it in so long, but we shall see. Got those legs off. I think I want to attach the lower legs of the, uh, like, I don't want these lower legs on these legs, if that makes sense. So I'm going to pop this off, pop. Okay, the boots aren't really heated up, so that sucks eggs, but I don't really care about these, you know what I mean? So those don't matter. It's just the thighs, really, that matter to me. So I'm going to pull these white knee pads off. Don't need these. And now all we have to do is get the Adam Cole calves onto... Good God, why is that so nasty looking? I did not like the way that looks. It looks hideous. All right, we're getting that... Dude, why is that so grody? There's like... what? What is this? Uh, what is that? That's gross. This is a used Bodalis. This is disgusting. What the hell even is what the hell is even that? All right, we got the calves off now We just got to get the Adam Cole calves onto these thighs right here So these are the money thighs. These are the ones we want on the figure and then uh, this RVD Okay, popped on that get this off of here Honestly feels good to be back, you know doing some surgery. You know what I mean? It's been a been, a, been an absolute minute since we have done this So getting back in the lab getting to do some more things man honestly feels pretty John Brown good So now we're gonna take the open knee pads and honestly should this have been a surgery episode? Probably to be honest with you the way everything's looking right now and the way the time limit is is just slowly But surely going down it should have should have absolutely been a surgery surgery episode so I do apologize for that and it's probably gonna hurt the numbers on the video but hopefully you guys showed up anyway and I appreciate it and give the video a like because it seems like surgery does better than appointment but I guess anything's possible so all right now RVD's done I didn't even plan on doing that today so now that's now that he's done now that just adds to the the bonus there however we're still here we're still working and I need this boot for this and this boot for this now we're gonna slide these big knee pads off I hate these big knee pads man like are they accurate to some people absolutely however they don't allow for any knee bend whatsoever so I just hate them you know what I mean I just I despise them like don't don't like them crap all right so this there is that calf, and this calf goes on the right leg, which is this. So these go together. I'm going to keep these together. Those go together, and then this leg can go over here in the pile of garbage. I still am grossed out by all that stuff that fell out of that Bo Dallas, bro. I don't know what the hell that was, but that goes together. And then this right here will go with this one. And we need to pop this out. And that goes there. This needs to go like this, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, money. So that goes like that, and that goes with that. Okay, so now I will need to heat these up like so with the boots so that they're easier to go on. However, I'm going to put that up there. I'm going to leave Bo Dallas over here and just let him get wrecked by the beam of heat. This is the left knee pad right here, and this is the right knee pad. That way we can keep up with those. So those will go there. And now, instead of not heating up anything, I'm going to heat this Becky head up just so I can keep it consistent across the board. Like, you might as well knock out more stuff. Like, some things don't need heat, but some things do. Elite One Taker Head could also be heated up. So I'm going to put that right there. Top Talents Kofi and Legends Eddie. Can we do all this in one? Should be interesting. All right, Brad, let's see what we got going. Uh, honestly, don't know what I need to do first. I feel like the I feel like the, the calves are probably the best thing to do. God in heaven, why do I do this? Uh, let's do this way. Jesus in heaven, Lord of mighty God. Let's put this here. Dude, it's so bad. Oh my God in heaven. That is so terrible. I need... I'm going to try and do it off screen. Fingers have gotten weak, man. So what happens? I go into the gym after taking a long hiatus. You're not going to be as good. You're not going to be as strong. The reason I yelled is, first of all, it's because it's, it's hot as hell. It's hot. All right, I got it in, but I did not want to do it off camera, but I literally had no choice. It was either that or just, like, I had to use my shirt to grip the peg because the peg was absolutely on fire. All right, we got that leg on there. Can we plop this onto Adam Cole? Boom, and then put the Undisputed Era boot on there. Boom. 
Wait, boom, look at that. Oh, sweet, merciful Jesus. Now we're almost there. Now see, in a perfect world, would not use Bo Dallas thighs. I would use William Regal thighs, which are a lot better in size. And if I can ever come across a William Regal for cheap or somebody has one out there they trade. Hey, look, I got that one. Oh, wait, I thought I got that one. Yeah, you thought, Brad, you thought you had it. Okay, there it goes. But if anybody has a Elite 45 William Regal out there for trade, I would trade it, you know? Or, if you want, if you don't care about the size of the thighs, I'll send you the Bo Dallas thighs, and you send me the William Regal thighs. And that way, you don't lose your whole William Regal figure. You just lose the thighs, and then you can switch the Bo Dallas thighs on there. And that way, you'll at least still have a William Regal. His thighs will just be bigger than the average William Regal thighs that you see out there on display. So, we can make that happen. But look, we're about to finish up Adam Cole. And I know those head sculpts are way too uh, cooled off now. There's no way they're going to go on there. But... Ugh. We will see, but Adam Cole seems to be completed. We'll take a look at him at the end with the rest of our team and unit once we get it completed. Uh, RVD and him are the only ones that are done, but as far as Elite One Undertaker, okay, the head sculpt came off perfectly. Now, I'm going to take the top talents, greatest hits head, put that on the Elite One like that. We'll take a look at that in just a moment, but now you're saying, oh, the greatest hits is headless. Now we're going to put the greatest hits or the ultimate edition head onto the greatest hits. Now that that will be something that we take a look at, and I think that'll make that figure look even better. Next up, we have the Legends Eddie. Got that head off. Now we go over here to the Elite 95. Pop that head off. Pop the Elite 95 onto the Legends, and then pop the Legends onto the Elite 95. Boom. Another one completed. Two more here, or three more, actually, because we got uh, Miro that we got to do. So Survivor Series Bex. Take that head off. Take the Elite 96 Kofi head off. Put this over in the trash. Um... Miro, throw that in the trash, put on the interchangeable unrivaled tin head, like so. Hold up, did I get it on there? No, if I can get this on, like so, all right. Then we got Top Talents Kofi, got that off, pop that on the Elite 96, good Jesus, is this even gonna go on? Got that on, put the Elite 96 onto the Top Talents, and then the basic Becky head, Plop that onto the Survivor Series Elite Becky neck. And then put this on here. And look, now, this is a good-looking basic. I'm just going to put this back in my crowd. But let's take a look at everything we did here today on Appointment. All right, guys, so here's everything that we did on Action Figure Appointment. Actually, a massive episode when you actually consider everything. Like, we have all these different fix-ups. Now, let's start off with Adam Cole because we finally got him done here thanks to Ty for giving us the, you know, the Undisputed Era Adam Cole. And I think putting these calves on these thighs is perfect. You know, it, uh, I, again, I, I'd prefer the William Regal one, so if anybody really does want to trade thighs i swear to god i'll make that happen because i it, it does bother me that he had like they're not like gigantic it doesn't look awful but i think i'd rather have the william regal thighs on there but this looks really good this looks a lot better than before it just makes him look like a little boy and i know that adam cole's not some jacked muscular gen genitive just insane jacked guy or something but it's still something you know and i just don't think it's realistic so this looks good i like this a lot man looks great so happy to have this finally to have it fixed up but there he is next up we have miro un Matt Series 1 with the head sculpt. This looks entirely better than the first go-around. I'm definitely going to keep him this way. It just looks way better. Even though this head sculpt's not as good as the pissed-off one, this looks in just way, way better than it did beforehand. So this this makes me happy. Looks really, really good. Miro, unmatched one, is now safe. We also have our Eddie Guerreros. Now the, the Legends one right here is looking like the chase. So I guess if I could find another Elite 95 Eddie to have that head sculpt on the regular, I'll probably do so. I do like the way this looks better, though. That just looks so clean. Double-jointed arms, green tights. We really need an ultimate edition Eddie Guerrero. Hopefully that'll be our next crowdfunder, which should, we should be finding out about that relatively soon, I would hope so, but there's Eddie Guerrero's. They look really nice. Uh, I like them. You know, I'm, I'm glad, because I have enough of the legends to have him, you know, fixed up and have him changed up a little bit is a very nice touch. And then we also have our Becky Lynch's, or our one Becky Lynch. I love the ponytail head, man. That just looks so much better to me. That, that may, like, I don't really care for this Survivor Series Elite, but I think the, uh, the hair pulled back looks a lot better 
better than the hair down. Just kind of fits the attire in my opinion, so that looks good there. I like that one as well. We also have our Kofi Kingston's. Really like the way the top talents turned out. That looks clean as hell, man. This attire with this head, like the pissed offness with the kick pads, looks clean. Then the smiling head sculpt with the blonde hair looks really good on the Skeletor gear, so I like both of these as well. Kofi Kingston turned out perfectly, and I like it. I, I like both of those. We also have our Undertaker's. Dude, look how sick this Greatest Hits looks with this head sculpt on there. Oh my god. Double jointed arms. The arms look bigger. Singlet Undertaker. That looks impressive. And then the Elite One with this Greatest Hits on there looks insane as well, dude. Look at that right there. How beautiful. Greatest Hits wave coming in in the clutch, man. Really like that as well. So there's our two Takers. And last but not least, we have RVD, which isn't much. It's just interchangeable knee pads. And we only did that for Adam Cole. So not a, not a huge game changer there. But that is everything we've done here today on Action Figure Appointment, man. Really, really fun day of getting back in the lab, kind of, you know, getting the, you know, just getting the juices flowing a little bit there, getting, you know, some, some exercise in with the fingers and the hotness. So that way we can get back in here more regularly and hopefully get a big episode of surgery in here soon because it's been an absolute while since we did so. But that is going to wrap up Action Figure Appointment, man. Hope you guys did enjoy. Let me your thoughts down below on what you think of Action Figure Appointment. But I'm getting out of here, man. Thank you for watching. Leave me your thoughts down below. Please leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. See you guys next time. Have a blessed one. I'll see you guys in the next, in the next one again, I guess. You cross